Thank you for joining BMW Blog. We're here at the international launch of the BMW i brand. We're standing in front of a new i3, and we're here with Dr. Elbreg, who uh, is actually head of electronics for the car. So, I've got a few questions for you, uh, Doctor, if you don't mind. You're welcome. Awesome. So, we'll start off with a few questions about uh, the battery. Um, the battery is uh, maybe a dirty word in some areas of the world. People uh, are afraid of. of batteries in cars, uh, electric cars, for the reason that maybe the battery will um, wear out too soon and need, need to be replaced, or maybe if you plug it in too early before it drains down, you'll somehow damage the battery. So maybe you could tell us about the technology in the i3 that negates those concerns. Well, we use in the BMW i3 the lithium technology for the battery, which is the state-of-the-art batteries, uh, which also use in the smartphones, and uh, we have done very good experience with them. Actually, you cannot do anything wrong with this battery. You can charge the car if it's full or half full or it's empty, so you can always charge it, and you, can, you cannot do anything wrong about that. Um, and uh, we have uh, designed the car and the batteries to, to hold for the whole lifetime of the car. That means at least 15 years and 150,000 kilometers. And we give for the batteries of the car a guarantee of 8 years and 100 kilometers. Okay. okay, great. Now, as far as the technology in the battery itself, you mentioned it's lithium ion. And uh, is there a reason why you, you chose lithium ion instead of other types of battery technologies? Like lithium polymer, for example, or...? Um, well, uh, the last uh, 10 years we have uh, did, uh, we did a lot of analysis of uh, uh, battery technologies, and at the moment the lithium uh, ions technology is, is the one which is able to uh, overcome the situation. There are a lot of, of companies producing that in the world, and it's not the same as the other technologies. All other, all other technologies are interesting technologies. We are uh, also doing some uh, experiments on there, but at the moment they are not, uh, not used for the technology. Okay. So, how much electricity is stored in this battery? Uh, we have uh, like 21 kilowatt uh, hours battery. Uh, and we can use about 18.8 kilowatt hours. With this uh, electric storage, we are able to reach a range of 130 to 160 kilometers in the Braxis years. Okay, yeah. great. Okay, I understand there's also a range extender that's optional for the car. Yeah. Um, so could you tell us a little bit about that option? Yeah. So, well, the range extender, it's, it's uh, like in, in engine, which is used at BMWs and some motorcycles, it has a power of 20 kilowatt, electrical power, and it's uh, used as an option for, uh, for the case if you need a little bit more range than uh, the, the, the range of, of the electric, of the, of the battery of what you have in there. Um, it's not a hybrid, it's just like a small machine to provide you with electricity if you need it. Okay, yeah, excellent. Great. And so in terms of total power output, how much horsepower does the, the vehicle have? Well, the, the vehicle has an electric motor of 125 kilowatt, which is about 170 horsepower. Okay, excellent. And it's for the weight of the car, we have about uh, 1195 kilograms uh, of weight using the 170 horsepower, but uh, it's a very, very dynamic one. Yeah. Excellent. Yeah. What are some of the ways that you were able to compensate for the weight of the battery through lighter weight construction of the rest of the car? Maybe different materials you used? Or... Yeah. Um, actually, in the, the, the weight of the battery is about 230 kilograms, which is actually a very heavy part of the car, and that's why uh, we in this car the, uh, the technology of the carbon fibers uh, in there and uh, this life drive architecture of the car to um, we, we were able to reduce the, uh, the weight of the car to compensate the, the, the weight of the battery. Yeah, we're looking at this car, now this uh, car usually you have some cars with, with uh, IC engines uh, with the same weight and we have a battery in there with 230 kilograms, 
uh, at the same time we don't have um, a decrease of weight comparing to other fish. Excellent. Well, it's a lot of fun to drive. Uh, I look forward to driving it a little bit more. And uh, thank you for your time with us at BMW Blog. Thank you.